rip this up myself. <laughs> that is the first custom piece of clothing I've ever made. What's good and good looking? My name is Chase Hudson, otherwise known as Lil Huddy. So in today's video, I thought it'd be a great idea to give back to the fans. So as you guys have requested that I show you guys what is inside of my closet, I thought I'd give you guys a little peek inside, show you a little bit of where my style inspiration is from. We are at my closet. Now before I go into this closet, I'm gonna need you guys to give this video a big thumbs up if you haven't already. I assume you have because you know, I'm like cool, I guess. Voila. <laughs> Come in. Where should we start? There's so much to go through. There are so many stories behind all of these clothes. Should we start the, the long sleeves? These are my long sleeves. These are my custom forces. And these are my docks. These I really like because they are definitely one of my favorite statement pieces. These are my Ma Mastermind X Doc Martens. I like these. These are hard. This is Bulbasaur. I got this one when I went to Hawaii. This was like the first island I've ever been to. This was one of like my many Bieber pieces. I used to rep Bieber all purpose to her. He had the sickest merch. These are my flannels and uh, sweaters. Sweaters? Yeah, sweaters. Throw next and stuff. This was my first custom piece of uh, clothing article. Article clothing. Yeah. Um, uh, this is this is the first like piece ever customized. As you can tell, I mean, like, look, it's just so perfectly done and so like neatly and nicely ripped. Just how I like it. <laughs> These are my sweaters for uh, the winter season. I don't really wear it because it's 90 degrees in October. <laughs> Okay, so these shoes right here are my Uggs. They're like running shoes, but they actually change colors. You can see on the inside, they're like rainbow. They just like change rainbow. And uh, since we don't have like sunlight right now, I'm just gonna just hold a lighter to it for long enough and it'll change color. And that's sick. Wait, I wanna do like a happy face. <laughs> These are my personal favorite shoes that I've ever owned. I actually got some custom like Dior charms um, for them. I'm also wearing some right now. These are another favorite of mine. I love the color brown for like styling. I think it's like one of my favorite colors. Uh, another uh, segment of my shoes, my Crocs. These are very important to me. They are my Chase Crocs. Chase from Paw Patrol, Chase from uh, me. I don't know, I love them so much and I kind of can just wear them wherever, whenever. And like, nobody can be mad. I mean, look at his face. Like, he's just the coolest. I wore these shoes, which are one of my personal favorites. A little bit, it's all nice and squeaky clean. They were so sick. I'm sick of these. Onto the bags. Uh, this is uh, the, my first like expensive piece of item. Like I made sure once I had uh, made 10 grand on merch that month, I was going to buy my dream backpack. This is my dream backpack. This piece uh, my grandparents had got for me for Christmas a few years back. This is like a full suitcase almost. If I'm traveling for like a fashion show, this is the one I'll put my suit in. But yeah, like I said, like my parents got, uh, like I said, my parents, like I said, my grandparents bought me this. And I hold it near and dear because my grandparents got it from me and I love them so much, so. Love you, Graham, Ma. This is uh, another bag. I wanted to fit in and buy an MCA bag, but since everyone has the same exact design, and I was looking for a bag that wasn't, you know, your everyday bag, but it's like my little low-key bag. It's not too big, not too small. It's just kind of like perfect size. And so I f with it. And then this is my little hug bag. I take this duffel bag with me everywhere I go. I didn't buy this. I didn't ask for this. It really just showed up in my door one day. And I was like, this is the coolest thing I've ever seen. I have a matching getting ready bag. Like, fuck you, I'm a little huddy. Like, kind of me, like... I'm all hoodie, by the way. I wore this flannel to New York. I really like this flannel. This flannel is right here is uh, inside out. You know, it could be a denim jacket too. I'm actually wearing a multicolored flannel, which is cool. Moving along down to the shirt aisle area. The nicer like button up stuff for like the dress fancy, just nice ooh la la, like nice little upscale casual dinners. I wear something like this on a boat, something like this, with like a, maybe like a, a black turtleneck underneath for like a little dinner or something nice. Another boat shirt. I buy a lot of these, I don't know why. 
I never go on a boat, but I have them there just in case. Very summer shirt right here. Still waiting for a day on the boat. This is a piece that Saint Laurent actually sent me. If you look here, uh, it says my name on it. it. Says Chase. More upscale, casual little dinner shirts. I have so many. So these are my racing jackets. I really wore these a lot. I wore these like uh, last year. This one's my favorite, the Red Bull. No, it wasn't even last year. It was like, whoa, that was like fucking seven months ago. I wore, the, I wore those so much. These are my Converse. I have a lot of Converse, some giraffe ones. I never have anything to match these with, but I think they're cool. Moving on, now we are in the jackets. My Playboy jacket. I used to wear this a lot. My Burberry jacket. I thought this was cool. A little New York type of moment. I wanna go back to New York. More Snow Leopard. I bought this for Barney's New York just before it closed down. It was on sale for like half off. It's like $2,000 half off. As I said in my last video, this is one of my favorite jackets. And for that reason is because very memorable to me. Back during Lights Out Tour, I, right after the first like phase, I hit a million followers. And um, this was my little splurge, was this jacket. And it was very like important to me at the time. Super iconic moment. This is like too much of a statement piece. I never find an outfit to wear these with. But I think it's cool. Moving along, we have down here is just like merch that has been released. This is out, this is out, this is out, that's out, that's out. This is the first merch that I released. The hoodie merch with the jellyfish. Gotta love the jellyfish. The crop tops. These are all of my t-shirts. Basically, I have a million band tees. As you can see, every single one of these shirts has a design on it. Either a band, a movie, a video game, or like a superhero. This is my last year's merch. It was Star Wars theme. I saw this on tour, then the lights out tour. That's it for this closet, but this is the one that's like connected to the gym bathroom. I have a closet in my room. For some reason, it's twice as small as my bathroom. It's like really small. But wait! There's more. It's in my room. There's another one in my room. Let's go. It's where I keep my accessories. And now we are in my little room closet. This is kind of where I keep most of my accessories, some of my everyday shoes. I wear these almost every day. These are like pretty like beat to the ground, like Air Forces. And I actually just got a new pair of the same exact shoe. But uh, it is a definitely a favorite of mine. Fear gods I wear just about every day as well. I got some of my like crazier earrings. I got every single one of my necklaces. This is my first necklace right here. It was bought in remembrance of my brother who passed away in the womb. It was my first necklace and my second tattoo. That's actually the first like meaning I really told. One of my tattoo meanings and my first necklace is for my brother. Uh, this is my guitar from the MGK movie that is coming out in like the next month. And then I wrote, <laughs> I'm just on like tickets to my downfall all day, which is super hard. So, uh, thank you, Kels. So now that we are back up here, it is time to wrap up this video. I know, so sad. I shed it too. But uh, don't worry, there's more content coming very soon. And so if you guys want to see more of that amazing, outstanding fantastic talented content make sure to leave a thumbs up like i want you guys to subscribe comment what you guys want to see next and make sure to tap the bell to know when it is exactly when i post fridays or when i post by the way i love you guys have a great rest of your weekend i love you guys peace out